I'm Marlene. I'm here at Philly Comic Con, and I'm here with Johnny Zito and Tony Trove. How are you guys doing today? Very good. Excellent. So what brings you guys to WizardCon today? Uh, we are promoting our comic, Moon Girl, from Red 5. The second issue is out this month, um, and it is available at your local comic shop. Awesome. So tell me a little bit about Moon Girl, about what you guys do. Uh, we're co-writers, and uh, we write this comic called Moon Girl, which um, is an old EC Comics character that we have kind of revamped and made, our, made it our own. Fantastic. And you guys have a studio, is that right? Yes, it's called South Fellini, and uh, we've uh, brought together some Philadelphia artists and managed to make some comic books for DC and Comixology. Uh, a lot of web stuff over the last couple of years. Uh, real fun stuff. Check us out, southfellini.com. Great. And what inspired you to take Moon Girl and make this comic? Inspiration. Um, we really wanted to write a superhero comic, but we didn't want to like invent our own. That's kind of lame. Right. Or well, not lame, but we didn't <laughs> want to do that. Um, and we thought like really cool to have an old character and kind of bring her into the modern world. So that's a huge inspiration was just wanting to do a superhero comic that that kind of matters, you know. And I heard something about you winning a contest to have the graphic novel published. Is that right? Uh, the way we got our start originally was uh, we were in the. DC Comics digital, uh, what do you call it, imprint, uh, Zuda Comics. And uh, we had won uh, the March 2008 competition for Best in Show or whatever, and our comic Black Cherry Bombshells, which was a zombie comic, uh, got to run for three years on their website, and now it's available on uh, DC Online. Great. And can you tell me a little bit about the genre that Moon Girl falls into? Uh, Moon Girl, tough girls versus monsters. Fantastic. Yeah. That sounds good. Yeah. And I know you've got a couple other projects in the works right now, if you want to talk a little bit about those. We're trying to jump from comics and do a little bit of movie work. Uh, we have a Kickstarter right now, alphagirlsmovie.com, for our Haunted Sorority House movie. Uh, every $10, $20 counts. You get your name in the credits, you get a free copy of the movie. Uh, check it out, please. We could use all the help we can get. And what's this about a giant order of maggots that I heard about? Yes, we have, uh, we have one scene uh, which is going to uh, involve a maggot infestation in this haunted house. Uh, so we are ordering tons and tons of maggots from a bait shop here in PA, uh, and they're going to deliver them day of. And it's very, it's very difficult. We've never worked with animals before, other than comic book artists. I, I don't know what we're going to do with them when we're done. Oh. Release them in the wild. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, well, it was so good talking to you guys. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you for having us. Absolutely, and definitely check out the Kickstarter, their website, and Moon Girl, which is out in stores.